That ball's hit well. Abreu to right center field. Trout at the wall. It is gone! The MVP's got the first grand slam. And it's 4-1 Sox. And Stassi said, keep it down with the glove before down on this game. Oh, yeah. Jose Abreu, the door has been broken. A grand slam. Wow. Well, we're pretty early in this season, and the big man already has two of those. You saw one in Anaheim, opposite field. You saw another one here. And what was a tough, tense, and tight baseball game has turned in. Oh, and two. Tapper first base side. Abreu is on it. Jose, go to the bag. One goal. Into that. Abreu, fair down the third base line. Four hitting, Jose Abreu's got an RBI, Eaton scores, and that's all they'll get. It's an RBI double here in the... <laughs> a one to Jose. That ball's drilled to left field. He came in with a fastball and got crushed. It's gone. Well, if you're that's the one he missed. Yeah, let's, let's see. If you're looking for one at bat that could turn things around, he got two inside fastballs the first time up. Well, hitters have memories also. Plesak apparently felt that Jose was going to swing. Oh, that's a long fly ball, deep left field, and Abreu has another. Second home run for Jose Abreu. Well, this is one of the things that we've been waiting for, and Jose kept saying, don't worry, it's coming. Don't worry, I'm a slow starter, but I'm going to have the numbers. And, and a blast to left. Two-run homer for Abreu. It looked like he tried to sneak a fastball by him inside. And it's 87-88. That doesn't work very well. Fifth home run. He hits 430, he'll probably win the MVP. You think maybe? Yeah, I think so. Jose to left field. That should get two home. Garcia touches. Nick Madrigal has run number four. And Abreu. For Naquin from Keiko. On the ground, first base side, Abreu's got it, oh. and he taps the bag, sprawling out to make the play. Jose, left center field, this ball carries, and one hops the wall. Abreu coasts into second base, Eaton. Ground ball, base hit, here comes Anderson. Here comes Madrigal. It's now eight to two. Get that out of the way. That is unacceptable. <laughs> Fair ball into the left field corner. Moncada on his way to third. He's going to try to score, and he will on a double. Nine. Jose tags it. Left center field, way back. Give the Sox the lead, it's five to three. Jose almost got one earlier. He saves his best for the Twins. He usually torments this club. And he hit his seventh, he's driven in 28. More important than that, the Sox have the lead. That's the first time tonight they can say that. To either side, however. Jose Abreu, center field, Kepler, it's over his head, kicking off the wall. Jose's got a double, he's going to try and make it a triple. Those legs are cooking in a third for an RB. He had trouble with the walk last year with the Giants. Abreu, singles to left. Tim's home, 
Madrigal follows, arises way offline. Two runs are home. Jose's into second. Untied. So now I got to <laughs> say that. Really? And you just put me in that scenario. There's Abreu playing a little break dance to first base. Broke his bat. Popped up beyond first base. Abreu over the shoulder. Oh, goodness. Wow. Jose Abreu for out number two on a slide and a daring. Now, you would assume he's going to get back to pickling fastballs like that. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Into left center field. This is gone. 96 out of here. And it's three to two. That's why the Moncada at bat was important. And that's why Jose hitting fastballs is even more important. And that's why his presence in the lineup makes things a whole lot. Jose drills this ball through the night sky, and it is fair. A two-run rocket for a 7-2 lead. He wrapped it right around the pole for some fireworks tonight. Jose has reached double figures. 2-2. Two -two. Jose tags it. Left center field. Madrigal's coming home. It's an RBI double. It two and two. Jose, right side, that gets through. Pass to Diving Nevin, two are on the way home. Jose does it again with two strikes. And it would be forthcoming, let's see if he can wait back. Jose lights it up. Yes, he did wait back, and bring him home. That ball was destructed. For a 3 nothing lead. Jose is one of the smartest hitters around. A couple of change-ups started the at-bat. He missed these. 1-1 one, one to Abreu, ripped into the right field corner. And the Sox will take the lead. Jose, a laser to right. And it's one zip. Hard hit through the left side. That's a long run for Guriel. Maybe Tim can get home. Super Joe's waving him around. Here comes Tim. He is there. It's five to two. Yeah. Jose cracks his ball to left field. It is out of here. His first hit in the series. And the Sox take the lead on this beautiful afternoon. Well, apparently Jose did learn something that first at bat. He took a couple of pitches and then took out the ball. He was going to move Tim along to third, which is exactly what he was able to do. And he's driven in by Jose Abreu. Anderson scores. Sox are up 1-0 after a 2-0 lead in the first. Jose drives this ball to left field. Badu at the wall. It is gone. This is a one-run ball game. Uh-oh. Well, we told you that Jose had one at bat in our ballpark where it looked like things had turned around. And he got a slider this time and got out in front of it, and it was a no-doubter. And Abreu takes it away from him. A double written all over it until Jose on the sinking line drive is able to make the play. Nice job. Two two. Oh, that ball's rocked by Abreu to left field, all the way to the wall. There are the two runs driven in for Abreu. On a change up and two and two. 
on the ground, right side, and he got it through that hole. Sox take the lead for the first time in the ball game on an Abreu RBI single scoring Anderson. Abreu hammers it to left. Long gone. All Sox tonight. Nine nothing. A fourth home run. And that one has just tied it with Carlton Fisk on the all-time White Sox charts with 214. Oh, one to Abreu. Oh, boy! No play for Larnick. It's nine to five. There's another millionaire on the moon. That was putting on him. The Dusties. That's a line shot to left field and falling down in front of her eyes, who liked what the ball was doing so much, he fell too. Abreu on his way to third, and Jose has himself three bases, and that'll do. As Ober was backing. <laughs> Adamas leading things off in the fourth. And his bat's just not listening to him yet. And a good play by Abreu to get there a step better than the runner. With this four run lead. Line, and it's going to get in there. Zabala will score. Anderson right behind him. When you go back to the minor leagues, you work on those things. Abreu in the air. This ball's going to go. He's starting to heat up again. Two to one. Fourteenth home run of the year. He's now driven in 82. Ford home run. Re there it is. 3-2. A brave skies it. Left field. Tie ball game. Are you kidding me? Well, I wasn't the only one that knew a curveball was coming. Fortunately, Jose did also. <laughs> Really like having Aloy back in the lineup, right behind him, and Abreu, a towering fly ball to left. Harrison at the fence. It's gone! Just Another like that. Another three-run homer. <laughs> it's almost like he was listening to our conversation. He's got 89 driven in. That's home run number 25. Halfway to second base and stopped. So I, I just don't know what could have happened. Abreu gives it a ride to left. Goriel back at the track. It is gone! That is the start the Sox needed. It is 3-0. Five pitches deep. Well, a good, way to, a good way to cure the ills of base running is just have somebody much improved. Down the left field line of Brayu. That is fair down the line. Here comes Robert. He could backstroke home. And Jose Abreu, Mr. August, makes it 6-2 to two with nobody out in the third. Corner to any breaking pitcher change it. Abreu gives it a ride. Center field. Ortega twisting in the wind. And it bounces up and over the top. Abreu got it by him. And the Sox get a couple. That ball was pounded to center. First and second, two down. And a drive out of the deep left. Gone! An absolute bullet. It's 3-0.
That's 29 home runs. He now has 107 driven in to retake the RBI lead. 1-1. One, one. Abreu into right field. Tim's coming home and the shutout's over. Sox have their first run this afternoon. In the air right field, Garcia won't get there. One run is home. Throw to the plate, not in time. Over again. You're kidding. Unbelievable. Popped up, first base side. Abreu, Hernandez, it's Abreu sliding, and he put it away. You might be a Super Bowl favorite. 1-0. Jose, number 30 on the way. There it goes. God, bring him home. Well, you said before the game that tonight would be the night for Jose, and he left nothing to the imagination. The only question there, a star certainly one of those and a catalyst for this entire baseball team. Jose is starting to rifle the ball up the gap in the right center. Tim's around third. Cut throw to the plate is caught off. One and two on Abreu. Two on, two out in the eighth. In towards right, Tucker coming on. That's going to drop in front of him. Anderson's going to come around. Here comes the throw up the line. And finally, the White Sox are on the board here in the eighth. Robert at first. And the 1-1 pitch. It's looped into right center field for a base hit. The White Sox take the lead. The other way. Yeah. And Abreu does what he does so. Back to her. Abreu bouncing ball past Correa. White Sox regain the lead. On his way to third, Robert. He'll take that base. An RBI from Abreu, and it's 7-6. to six. This one is in the air to right, and deep back goes Fowler. He's at the wall, and that ball is gone. Ryan Braun with a home run puts the Brewers on top, one to nothing. His eighth home run of the year, and the Brewers strike first. Yeah, he shoots this thing out to right center. Again, Braun, he's got a long history against Wayne Wright.